in our previous tutorial we have discussed big o notation but there is a slight correction in my previous video where i said that our aim is to find out a smallest rate of growth which is greater than i have left one thing here greater than or equal to right so rest of things are fine now let us start our new tutorial here which is on asymptotic notation and the second notation is big omega notation so similarly we have a problem for which if we have found find out an algorithm whose running time is fn now how now if we want to say fn equal to big omega of gn then we first need to find out a constant c where cgn is less than or equal to fn and cgn should be greater than or equal to 0 for the c which which is greater than 0 and a value of n which you call n naught should be greater than or equal to 1 so we need to find out a function gn so let us try to draw this function here it should be something like this maybe sometime it goes above and then remain below fn so if you see here we have n naught now you can define this notation formally like omega of gn equal to fn such that there exist positive constants c and n naught such that c into g n is greater than 0 and c of g n is less than or equal to f n for all the values of n which is greater than or equal to n naught so we will consider an example to understand this notation let us take an example where f n equal to 3 n plus 4 and g n equal to n so can we say that f n equal to omega of g n so to prove this or to find the answer of this question we need to find out a constant c g n c which is multiplied by a function g n should be less than or equal to f n so let us put the values in this equation c of n should be less than 3 n plus 4 and if we look carefully we can put the value of c equal to 1 in this equation so we will get n less than 3 n plus 4 and here if you put value of n equal to 1 or we can say n naught is equal to 1 or any value that is greater than or equal to 1 this condition is being satisfied so for these two values that is c equal to 1 and n naught is less than or i think i have done a mistake here i will correct it right now so this n naught 
should be greater than or equal to 1 and for this condition is being satisfied. So, we can say that f n equal to omega of g n. Technically speaking, if you have any function g n like log of n or log of log n and if these functions are smaller than this g n we can say that this condition is being satisfied. Technically we have find out lower bound on f n or it is not just lower bound we have find out the tight lower bound on this f n. So, we can always say that f n is equal to omega of g n for all the functions which are lesser, lesser than g n. But our aim here is to find out largest rate of growth that is g n which is less than or equal to given algorithmic algorithmic rate of growth that is f n. So, here we will be able to find out the lower bound on the given algorithmic function. In next tutorial we will be discussing theta notation. Thank you so much.